Hello to all of my Leos. This is Queen Amon-Ra coming to you with a continuation of Sunday's reading. Even though you mean we watching it on Sunday, <laughs> the reading is for the 8th of January through the 8th of February, 2024. Let's get into it, Leos. Let's see what your cards have to say during this year of wealth as we're coming up to closing out this cycle and entering into a whole new cycle on 111, right? So let's go. See what your cards have to say. Yep, two of wands. So it needs you to move on from something. Something that um, has maybe exhausted you. That's something you're going to purge because you had a lot of opportunities coming your way. The things that you've been praying for, opportunities are coming your way, like new money. This money is coming from source. So you could be looking for money to come from one direction, something from the past. And source is like, actually, I'm sending money that's coming in. Um, something that you prayed for. So like, for instance, you could have been waiting on money to come back from something like, um, like a, uh, hmm, let me see what an example. Hmm. Anyway, you could have been waiting for money to come back from one thing and sources saying, I'm trying to send money. I'm trying to send money away from something else. Everything is lining up perfectly for you. Here we have the three of uh, the three of pentacles. We also have everything is fine. Sources saying everything is fine. So, And then we also have the nine of swords. So sources saying everything is fine. Money is coming in. So make sure you prepare yourself for it. Here you are on your throne. Here you are on your throne. So money is definitely coming in for you for something. So congratulations in advance. So, so it's just saying, you know, purge whatever it is you've been overthinking to a point of exhaustion and burnout and move on from something. So Princess of Cups, Seven of Wands, the God card, the Temperance card, the Nine of Cups, and also the Six of Wands. Source has been trying to tell somebody to move on for a long time for somebody who has a God complex. And somebody who has a temper, their energy adds to your fire, but not in such a positive way. So it's just saying, get up, move on from those types of energies. You're trying to prepare yourself to live a calmer life, like to live a more um, receiving mode life, like in healthy feminine energy, trying to get more structured with your emotions so you can start being in receiving more of more trips, more money. More of the things that you want to grow in your life. So I definitely see victory. Here we have six and two is eight. Source is trying to fast track you to a particular life. I see you being able to defend your decision to move on from something without even coming across as defensive. And I'm seeing a lot of wishes being fulfilled, Leos. So that is what you're purging. Somebody is purging something from the past. Getting on your horse, moving forward, you know, something to a point of burnout that you felt like it was a nightmare. 12, I am a visionary. So creativity is a driving force in your life. Your imagination is rich and you're able to express your feelings and insights in unique ways that others can benefit from. Somebody is definitely born to inspire, right? And so with all this fire here, this is where your spirituality and where you need to take action. So it's definitely wants somebody to increase, increase their spirituality moving forward, spend more time in it. So you're gonna have to purge something else to return back to pure consciousness and purging would be, I need to release something that was called from my past that was causing some level of burnout for me that just for some reason is just heavy on your mind. Every time you start thinking about it, you start getting burned out all over again. So that's where the defending that I can move on from something without coming across as defensive and also purging the types of energies that um, cause you to be reactive to things let us close it out let us close it out leos let us close it out my body is a wondrous and magnificent machine and i feel privileged to live in it i feel privileged to live in it all right leos that is what i have for you all that is what i have for you all like i said trying to keep the monday motivational videos short and sweet but that is what i have for you so um, source definitely wants you to add some structure to some things. Start for the temperance card is really about purpose, balancing out, balancing out things. It's just like, you know, when life happens, 
Um, I still am a divine being of light who had a human experience. So I need to shed that dark side of the number four. It's my way or the highway. I have to have everything my way. I got to shed that so I can move on and receive more blessings and release the burnout part. That's the part that you're purging. Yeah. 2024 is going to be a very wealthy year for, it is the year of wealth, right? But you want to make sure you land on wealth would be like the eighth card in tarot. That is, um, you want to land on the light side of number eight, not the dark side of number eight. So find out what your purpose is, learn how to control your temper, get away from people who can't control their temper, um, because they will ruin you. Their energy will ruin you. And sources saying they will ruin your reputation. They'll mess up the money that's trying to come in, um, because when you talk about like the page and three, that would be like four, right? So they will cause you to be less conservative with your time slash money. So you're spending so much time being burned out and frustrated, you know, with those types of energies. Because they keep bringing up nightmares and all of this other stuff that happen. And it, it's just counterproductive. Again, make this a very wealthy year for you all. And this, this continuation of Sunday's reading is really all about what you're purging. And that's for every single zodiac sign. What is every zodiac sign purging? For yours, it's just purging that burnout. I got to stay connected to things to a point of burnout, the anger, the frustration. Or, and part of it is getting rid of people around you who have a God complex. It's their way or the highway. They're vindictive. They jump to conclusions about everything. They always on go when it comes to something negative, um, vain, impulsive energies. So that is what I have for you, Leos. I will see you all on midweek Wednesday. Bye.